That picture knocking him out. That's it. This picture knocking him out. This is John Tenanga of here for Pro Boxing Fans, joined by Isaac Chamberlain here at the Media Workout. Uh, not long to go now to you finally fight Mikhail Lawal uh, at the O2. A lot's been made, Isaac, of Mikhail not turning up today. Uh, I mean, known you for a bit. I don't think you're particularly bothered, but uh, yeah, what's your reaction to that? Uh... Weird, just weird old man. Should come here and promote the fight. All right, you had sparring, but I had sparring too. I got a training session after this. So, here's what it is. This is just a part of the game that you play, but here's what it is, man. It's weird. What's he going to be saying about Isaac Chamberlain after the fight? What's Mikhail Lowell going to be saying about you, do you think? Uh, honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm not really thinking about that. I'm thinking about my performance and how what I'm going to do. I'm not thinking about what he's going to do. In terms of like how, how what the British scene are going to say about Isaac Chamberlain now after this fight, is it about making a statement to them? Of course, and, and I definitely believe I will make a statement. That's that's the whole plan. I'm planning to make a massive statement. In, in terms of Lawal uh, on paper, where do you think he ranks in terms of the British guys you've faced in your career? Uh, You know, it's crazy. I haven't even been thinking about that. I've just been thinking about who's in front of me and what I have to do and the tactics that my coaches have given me to beat this guy. I haven't thought, oh, yeah, he's this, he's that, or whatever, whatever. I've just, that, that's that's how locked in I am. Locked in I am. It's like three weeks away, locked in, man. Do, do you feel more locked into this fight because of the build-up than previous fights? Or is it is it yeah, similar? Yeah, a little bit better. A little bit more locked in. You know, I'm a little bit more locked in. But I just can't wait to sink my teeth into this fight, man. Just, just to be a part of this amazing event. How, how important do you think your experience uh, will play in this fight? Yeah, I'll play a lot. I'll play a lot. You know, I've been, I've been in there with the biggest punches. I've been in there with the best. Do you know what I mean? So the only two losses are to world champions. So I know that definitely it's going to be great, man. And uh, how, in your mind, how do you see this fight? What, what do you picture when you see this fight? Yeah, I picture knocking him out. That's it. Just picture knocking him out. Will that be maybe one of the sweetest wins of your career? Probably. Because of all the build-up. Yeah, probably will. And then uh, just a couple more. Uh, we obviously saw Jair Pattaya become uh, world champion. What did you make of his win over Thompson? Yeah, oh, just an amazing performance. Like, dominating performance. You know, I think it was, might have been a bit of a big, too big of a jump for Jordan Thompson. But nevertheless, he dominated him, man. I mean, you know, a lot of, like Eddie Hearn's been saying, look, no one beats up a tie. A lot of people have been saying that, but I'm sure Isaac Chamberlain believes he beats Jai up a tie, right? Yeah, of course. Uh, when I get my chance, definitely the world will see. And uh, just sticking on him for one more minute, uh, he said afterwards that he's going to be sparring Fury or Fury wants him in camp for the Uzi fight. Do you think that would be good preparation yeah, for Fury? Definitely. They have similar styles, you know. They have similar styles. He has a similar style to U6, so yeah, it would be great. Very, very good. What, what's your overall thoughts on Fury Usyk now it's apparently signed? I was on, honestly, on, only until it's in the ring, in, they're in the ring, that's when I'll be like, okay, it's happening. All of this signed, why do you need to announce that something's been signed? Do you know what I mean? That's fair enough. Well, uh, Isaac, best of luck last few weeks uh, of camp, and uh, we look forward to seeing this Mikhail Wildfire. Thank you very much.